Oh boy, this just popped right in front of me. This is a tier 4.2 group dungeon. I was actually on my way to do the static dungeon, but I'm going to do this instead. There might be some good loot in here. We're going to we're going to do some fame farming and uh yeah, let's get it. <laughs> These dungeons are awesome. This one even is a heretic one, which is my favorite. I have the wrong skills on. Oh boy. crap. Let me kill this real quick and um <laughs> put on the right skills. <laughs> Whoops. Alright, you can see I wasn't even prepared. Okay, let's go. Uh, cursed Tar, Cursed Beam, everything else looks good. Alright, we're all set. We have the food. And this is what I'm talking about. This is like four mobs. We can get seven mobs. And yeah, it's gonna get nutty and wild. Like, the fame is gonna go just outrageous mode. <laughs> Look at them melt. And watch the fame pop up. It's so good. It is nutty. That was one pull. It took a few seconds. 4K, 4K. 4K. Oh, man. 9K. Here, let's get everyone in the puddle. Alright, everyone has to puddle. Party in the puddle. 9K. Silver's not bad either. It's okay. It, remember, this would be like... The, that 9k would be like 15k if I had um, premium active. Those 4k's would be like 7k's. Uh, the guy with the little, with the shield here, he's kind of annoying. But uh, we got triple explosion barrels. Let me get this guy with the barrel. And his mage friend. There we go. We're pulling everybody today, and we're just gonna melt as many of them as fast as possible. I got stunned during my W. Look how fast they die though. These guys get the big fame, too. <laughs> 10k on the mage. I don't want the tier 2 equipment. 13k on the beefy boys. Oh, yes. If you see the purple butterflies on a dungeon, it is, uh, you need to go into them, because they're great. Once I finish this, we'll, we'll start doing, we'll, we'll farm some statics for a bit. I'm at 47.222 million combat frame, fame credits. And, uh, yeah, it's, it's good. <laughs> We're gonna fame up so much before these new weapons and armors and stuff come out. Oh, I, I freaking casted my helmet in the wrong direction. I just I just woke up from a nap. I um, I have not warmed up at all. <laughs> Alright, so grabbing some loot. Mm-hmm. I have auto respec on, I have my satchel on. Make it, Just make it sure, man. Just making sure. Okay, more loot. 13k there. This is kind of a scary room. We got four fire mages. Oh, we can handle that. It's just getting them all to, like bunched together is going to be a little annoying, but once we do that, we're fine. Oh, they're dropping my health fast. That's bad. But I can drop their health fast too, because I, you know, I'm, I'm a dark wizard, <laughs> basically. Oh, that was a scary pull. They were hurting my HP big time. Oh, there's there's a fork in the road. We go left because of the the candles count as torches, I believe. I think I don't know. Maybe I I did that wrong. But um, this could be a legendary chest. I don't think I can kill a legendary chest boss with my my loadout. I don't. I didn't bring a druidic staff. <laughs> kill the rats. Let's heal off the rats. Grab the runes. I feel like I'm doing this slowly. I'm, I'm not, though. I know I'm not, but I feel slow. And I don't know if this is the right route or not, but we're going to it. Uh, nope, that's the way forward, so we're going to leave that. Someone else can invade the dungeon and take the other path, so we want to make sure that we clear the other path right away. How did I mess that up? I always... In Heretic Dungeons, I always get it wrong. Oh, well. It's like, I guess you don't follow the, the mine tracks or something. Whatever. Morgana crates, please drop one. I have never, I have, all of my time playing, I've never received a Morgana crate drop. It's just a blue chest. Which, um, archers are actually pretty deadly um, in these dungeons, so I need to really be careful and take them out. They're going to do the heavy snipe that's going to hit my HP pretty hard. Well, about 25% of my maximum HP. The, uh... The knife dudes, the the thieves, they they have the same crap. That's a, that, oh yeah, I can I can duo that. It's this guy, the archers, whatever, just, just murder them. And don't stand in that. <laughs> don't stand there. 
You know that guy? With the, he throws the mines. He's one of the bosses. That's what he says. Alright. The Morganas. The Morganas and the Heretics are teaming up, lads. They're coming for us. We're gonna we're gonna get a little bit more HP and then we're gonna engage. Now the the thing is oh I didn't want to hide that. No, pop that back out. Uh, Big Spence here, he's actually quite difficult. Uh, I don't know if I can actually do this, but we're going to try without Druidic, uh, whatever. And Puddle Time, because he's going to belly flop us. Oh, shoot, we could we can just pull Big Spence. I don't need to fight both at the same time. Why would I? Okay, there we go. Hey, <laughs> we just fight Big Spence. We don't need to fight the other dude. All right, and we're just going to run. We, we can just run him around. Oof, that hits so hard. Let's make sure we keep cursing him. Yeah, we can just kite this dude. He's gonna belly flop us here. Or he's gonna big slap us, big clap and slap. Uh, I do need to heal soon, though. So we're gonna throw everything down that we have. And hopefully heal something. Don't let him sleep us. And yeah... I wouldn't be able to fight both of them at the same time, because Big Spence, he's a he's a freaking hard hitter, man. He is a big boy. He's a scary boy. Yeah, see, he's got... I'm going to potion, because I'm, I'm afraid. I don't want him hitting me again with that. Laser beam kill! Ah. And there we go, right in the beans. Right in the subscribe. <laughs> now, it's just you and me, Mr. Morgana Enforcer. It's kind of funny that they weren't actually working together. He's, uh, he, he clearly saw me kill Big Spencer there, and he's like, yeah, good job. We hate the heretics. I was, I was never their friend all along. It was all a scam or something. I don't know, man. We're just going to hit him really hard with all of our spells. And, um, you know, he's going to die too because he didn't help Big Spence, so he kind of deserves it. We're just trading blows. He's stabbing me in the guts. I'm cursing his brain with evil... Avracadavras or something. I don't really know, man. But hopefully we got some fat loot in this chest because uh, these all respect <laughs> money dollars. Like I started at ninety nine point five. I'm at ninety eight point nine already. <laughs> oh no, he's spinning, bros. He's spinning. That's fine. Dump all the magics. Thirty four thousand HP and it's just gone. Chest time. What do we have in the chest today? We have 59,000. Well, I'll take it, I guess. Tier 6, um... Tier 6 plate armor in there. Soldier armor. That's cool. I brought a bear with me for the statics. Um... <laughs> but we found this dungeon instead. Aren't we, uh, aren't we lucky to find the dungeons? Hmm. Not much going on right now. Reddit is super pissed about the, the donkey, the mule video. They're all like, ban Swole Benji, he's exploiting, he's exploiting, ban him, ban him! That's not an exploit. It's it's a clever use of game mechanics. There's, there's no exploiting. That's a real dangerous pull. I'm just gonna skip it. I mean, yeah, it's good fame. I hate that I'm going to not get that fame from that pull, but I don't feel like doing that pull. I'm just gonna run away from him. You have ran away from battle. Because we want to get to these pools with the rock throwers here and some, oh, the miners. Get the miners. Yeah, get them. Start shocking everybody. Start puddling everybody. Start lasering everybody. Alright, yes, indeed. Ooh, ah, tier 3 soldier armor. No thanks. I have a tier 6. I don't need you, tier 3. Double Thieves, not good. I don't have any of my cooldowns. I don't have my heal. So, I'm just going to have to face tank all of this and just laser them hard. So, I am not enjoying this one. I might have to potion this. Oh, they hit so hard, man. Oh, no. Kill them. Good. We got them. We did it. It's over. <laughs> Blow vape. Blow vape into their faces. That's the. That's why I call the, the Mage Cowl. Fire breath, it's like a vape. <laughs> You're a Frank Hassel vape juice blower. <laughs> Kill, destroy, heal, self healing, self care. You have already completed 1,250 faction points for the day. Wow, and this is only the second floor of the dungeon. See, you get a lot of faction points for soloing these things. That's why we do them. 
Let's just, uh, I think this might be Fountain Boss. No, it's Green Chest. Three mages and a thief boy. I want to, like, do these separate, but I don't want to... Uh, whoops. <laughs> it's too late now. You gotta kill these dudes a little bit quicker. Yeah. Okay, we have to kill all of them quicker. Uh, or we die. So I have to melt the mages and then maybe reset, because I wasted the barrels. Because the thief guy, he's gonna, he's gonna hit pretty hard here pretty soon, but... I mean, we already chunked him for 40%. We might as well just stay in the fight. Maybe. I don't know. I can I can back I can still back out of this. <laughs> oh, and the race is on. DPS race. I am 40%. He is barely 40%. I'm gonna wait on my shoes so I can laser shoes. There we go. And the heal. Let's go. Throw the heal down. Throw the vape juice. Hit the armor just in case. I don't wanna I don't wanna risk it. Okay, green chest. Let's go green chest. You could be a good green chest today. What's inside? 24,000. <laughs> Remember when Yellow Zone solo dungeons gave way more than this, and now the group dungeons don't give anything? <laughs> They're gonna nerf everything until no one's playing the game anymore. It's like, they just want to retire. <laughs> oh man, New World is like, dying. I, I know, uh, you know, no one cares about New World on, on these videos, but man. They're like, we are, we are retiring the forums, we're not gonna use the forums anymore, it's like, okay, it's a sign that the game's dying. Delete the forums, delete them. Explosive barrel, explode, give me, give me your explosive power. Oh yeah. You know, these guys, like, what's in the barrel? Gunpowder? Where's the guns at? Rats, meep meep, I'm a rat, I want the cheese. Burn and oh yep, just the helmet kills the rats. Look at the rats; they give six hundred each. Uh, oh, there's a little snitch barrel. I haven't seen the snitch barrels in a while. Who's there? Over here, lads! Kill him! It's the player character. You have to kill him now, Mrs. Finster. I'm telling the principal. <laughs> oh, crossbow bros. I think we have purple boss. Purple chest up ahead. Oh boy. What are we gonna do? We're gonna celebrate. With hopefully some fat loots. Fat loots to make people jealous. <laughs> fat loots to make people be like, wow, I should be soloing these kinds of dungeons, man. We should totally solo these dungeons all the time forever. That's what. I don't know. Oh, I got stunned by barrel and by club. By barrel and by club, I will slay you, player character. That put me in combat, so I'm gonna I'm gonna walk over here until my health starts regenerating. There we go. Now I'm gonna go back. Freaking barrel dudes! How dare they slam me? Snitch barrel. Dang it! I tagged that one with the lightning. Now I have to kill it. If if you hit a trap enemy. <laughs> With uh, with with a Thetford cape or something, then it, they're considered a tagged mob, and you have to finish them. Otherwise, it could lock the chests. If there's at least five dudes alive in a dungeon, you can't open the chest. It's really stupid. I mean, they give good fame. It's 13k, and sometimes item drops, but whatever. They're just it's what, it's, uh, uh, if it's Whip Guy, it's really hard to kill Whip Guy. I, I really don't want to fight Whip Guy, but I'll do it. It is possible to do it. It's just really stupidly hard. Um, if you set from a distance, he autos you the whole time. If you set in melee, he will spin whip you. No, it's cannon. I don't know if I can kill cannon. 52,000 HP. I don't think I can do that. He hits freaking super stupidly hard. I'm going to go really, really hard. Like, I'm just going to... I have to kill, actually, the adds on the other side. You have to kill this guy. Snitch Barrel. Snitch Barrel's gonna tell the boss. So I gotta kill Snitch Barrel immediately. Heretic Screamer. <laughs> oh, help me. Help me, admin. He's griefing. <laughs> He's griefing the test server. <laughs> oh, man. Creeper. Can we, uh, can we just kill everything here real quick? Like this? Please. And these guys won't bunch up for me. They are keeping their distance. Alright, we took out these guys. 
Don't worry, I'm gonna I'm gonna try the cannon boss. I don't think I can do it though, because he hits hard. Just his auto attacks are gonna chunk me for like 20% of my health, I'm pretty sure. Take this. I'm a siege weapon in a cave. I make no sense to exist. <laughs> I really don't. Like a little barrel ballista, dude. Okay, so uh, we have to really hit, we have to like just go all in on this guy. Boots and everything at the start. I have full mana, full HP. Puddle into boots, into armor, into vape juice, into self-heal. And you see, he's chunking the crap out of me. Like, look how hard he's chunking. And I've only got 20% of his HP. He's gotten almost 40% of mine. And yes, I'm aware I got hit by the flamethrower. I know. Uh, look at that. His autos. His bang-bang attack. <laughs> I don't think I can kill him, dude. He's just, he hits way too hard. I have no, I don't have enough sustain. I'm just gonna, yeah, I'm, I'm gonna duck out of that fight. See, boom, 784 damage per hit. I could only tank two more of those and I'm dead. No thanks. That's a tough pull without HP. And Snitch Barrel might pull more. How do we do this one? We do it by letting myself fully heal. Alright, we're almost there. We're almost ready. I'm still stretching. I'm still waking up from a nap. Okay, double mages. Puddle. Armor. Vape juice. The, the full heal. Hit them with the laser beam now. Snitch barrel, there's no one here, dude. You're gonna have to fight. You're gonna have to, like, throw your lid. He throws his little barrel lid. He lives in that barrel. He shits in that barrel. He dies in the barrel. Barrel born, barrel bred, and pretty soon he'll be barrel dead. <laughs> we did. We did the pull. We got the fame. Now we can get these juicy pulls. This is what I'm talking about. We got miners, we got rock throwers, we got triple mages. Oh man, triple. Oh, this is really bad. We gotta heal immediately. We gotta, like, nuke this pull now. <laughs> <laughs> oh, dude. Oh. <laughs> they would melt my HP bar if I did not do anything. I gotta throw out those tier 2 items. They are grossing me out. Ew, they're poop colored. Get out of here. No, I don't want your poop colored weapon, armor, whatever. And laser beam. Melt the little, the little twerps here. Jeez. The, it's so much fame. <laughs> You're pulling so enemies at once. 2,500 faction rep completed in 18 minutes. Oh, man. I mean, it, you know, statics are still faster. I'm going to tell you right now, statics are still more fame and more faction points. Oh, dude. If I could get four thieves, I, I ain't risking that. Thieves just, they melt you, bro. They kill. They are deadly little dudes. Take them out. Taking out the thieves. Uh, the boss down below is just blue chest at this point. Um, I guess we can do it. Might as well finish up the dungeon. Just a little two-floor dungeon. Alright, I want to make sure I hit crossbow guy. I'm just going to go all in with my spells. All in with my spells. I don't have heal. I, don't, I guess I don't need it. They're just going to die before I need to heal, so... Save that for the next pull of double, that's what, Archer Thief? Next pull is the big guy and then two thieves, so that one's a more difficult pull. Okay. Puddle, Archer, we'll just finish him off. He's gonna do Stun Arrow. I gotta sidestep that. Oh no, it's not Stun Arrow, it's Flame Arrow and uh, Snipe. Dang it, that hit hard, I gotta heal. Man, you making me heal out here? It's like, a, it's like a fight in an anime, and it's like, oh, you actually made me try. You actually made me use 1% of my power. Blah! Double thief, big boy. Ugh. Uh, yeah, we got 10 seconds on our heal. I don't want to fight this without that, so I'm going to wait. It's going to wait on cooldowns. Just a little bit. Here, let's go all in again. Just dump everything we have. I don't want to get the big boy clap that she's doing right now, because that's asleep. You can dodge the normal clap. It's the sleep. You don't want to get sleeped into uh, the dagger boys. 
into the collab. I mean, that's just asking for it. I hate this pull so much because it's hard to get them bunched up. Like, they don't- they won't ever, like, pull together. <laughs> See, it's really awkward. But uh, we kind of did it there, I think. I think we got them now. That's right, you must stand together, brothers in arms, and die at each other's side. And then when someone digs you up in 10,000 years, they'll call you lovers. That's right. This is... Yeah, it's double big boy one thief. Which we have to wait... So he doesn't pull the damn boss. I could just kill these two and then kill him solo. I'll just do that. Or right, now here we go. go ahead and pull him that way. Puddle into armor, into self-heal, into faith juice. And now we laser melt. Oh, don't stand in the claps. Ooh, uh. I don't want the tier two boots. I don't want them. Get them out. Get out of my inventory, tier two boots. And now for the boss. He's doable. He's kind of annoying to do though, but we should be able to get him. Just go all in, all of our abilities. Hit him hard, hit him fast. Hit him with the, the heal. He's chop chopping. Hit him with the laser beam while we still have him shredded. Alright, and that was a good trade. Now I just need to make sure I dodge all, everything he does. So I don't have to potion. And he's whirling. That's gonna hit hard if I don't have boots. Yep. He even autoed me after. What a... He's he's a freaking grandmaster. Alright, we got a boots into armor, into vape juice, into self-heal, into laser beam. And we gotta dodge that. Yep. Do I potion here? I might have to potion this. Nope, he's chop chopping. Okay, good. Yes. Keep doing that pattern. I think we got him. I don't want to potion you, but I'm going to potion you. Oh, man. Oh, no. Don't get hit by that. Oh, crap. This is it. The final countdown. Okay, we did it. I had to potion, though. That sucks. Potion's like 8,000 silver, man. 45,000 silver, though, is our reward. I don't know if it's worth, but, um... Got the 4-1 cleric cow there. Alright, so that dungeon is completed. We were at 45-222, and it's... Was it 45? I don't know. It was definitely not 48. I don't remember. Rewind the video. Uh, Limhurst, you captured the outpost while I was out here? Excuse me? I didn't, I didn't give you permission to do that, Limhurst. And the, you know what? It's not even fully captured yet. It's still, like, mid-capture. We can change history, boys. Limhurst was never here. Limhurst is doing something. Maybe they're still in the zone. I need to remove my shield. Okay, there we go. And, uh, no, Limhurst. You are not allowed. You are not allowed to capture this outpost. Hopefully there's no greens in the zone. That's right. We're gonna solo Limhurst. <laughs> oh, man. Aha! I'm Limhurst. Look at me, dude. Alright, we need to start doing all the things that, you know... <laughs> that we do to bosses here. Aha! I can tank. Tank that. And I don't want to get hit by the big bleedy, bleedy hit there. I'm going to let the mount take care of that. And... <laughs> Wait for it! Uh-oh. Don't want to get hit by that. There we go. Let the mount handle it. Okay, so Limhurst did capture the zone. That's fine. We'll take it back. We got it. We got. We got a little helper here. He's gonna. He's gonna heal me, I guess. <laughs> don't don't pull Boris though. That makes the fight really hard. <laughs> That's why we're. Not... Okay, I'm gonna. I'm just gonna tank it. I gotta heal. This guy will heal me up. This Tissue Farm dude. Yes, Boris has been failed. Okay, and now we just recap it back. We just back cap. Let's see. What is it looking like? They captured that. They're up there. I don't know. Oh, we got we got a Limhurst boy. <laughs> he said lol to Sioux Farm. What are you wearing, bro? You got the tier 7 too? Oh, you're out here skinning. Okay. <laughs> Hello. <laughs> Hello. You made it in the video. Hello. Hey, yo. I'll give you some snow and I'll point the flag down. We captured it. Yes, we did. Now, I'm going to hang out because I got to wait for the dude to spawn. Otherwise, the green guy can just run up and recap. Uh, right behind us, so I'm gonna just chill for a bit.
And while we do that, um, yeah, there it goes. All right. <laughs> yeah, this is our zone. It would be cool if I if I captured it before it fully gapped, but you know that's my bad. <laughs> okay. So let's uh, let's look at that fame that we uh, that we are in forty eight seven. We we need to co copy that number. Uh, forty eight seven. Hold on, I gotta type this on the screen because we're making a video about this. That's what I was originally doing. Uh, starting fame, starting combat fame credits. Forty eight seven eighty four nine thirty. All right, we have it on the screen. There it is. It's right there. See it. And, uh, yeah, we're gonna, just, we're gonna maybe do some statics if people aren't, like, clogging the zone up. It is a Friday night, so there might be a bunch of people doing them, which would make it harder for us to do them, because then there would be less mobs to kill. Oh, well, that's life. And I'm gonna turn that off now, now that we have it saved. Okay, let's pull... Let's pull some mobs. Only two? Was that all I get? Yeah, there's this freaking guy here, dude. Freaking Joey. Joey, he's he's doing the one-handed axe. Joey, you're stealing my thunder here. You're stealing it. And then we got Luan. He's also, hey, I mean, he's, you know, he's out here fame farming too, man. I can't, it's not my, it's, I don't own this place. I just, I just farm here, bros. See, there's people out there that are like, Swell Benji ruined this place for me now. Now everyone's doing it, and it's like, okay. So everyone benefits. <laughs> oh, the freaking archers, bros. The freaking archers. We can't let them stun us. The number one stunner. <laughs> what is that from? Is that a rap video? Rap music video or something? I don't know. Is, that a, is it wrestling? Yoinkers, give me the book. Give me the book. Give me the book. Uh, what is it? Uh, 27 minutes so far on this fame farming video. We are fame farming. That's us. We are the fame farmers. <laughs> uh, let's see. Oh, dudes. We got one art. Oh, oh, this is... I don't think I can do this pull. I bit off more than I can chew here. I'm dead. I'm dead. This is, this is game over. I'm dead. It's over. We have to mount up and leave. <laughs> I actually got the mount up. That's wild. Let's wait. I can. I can. I can wait on cooldowns. Maybe if I just dance around on the mount, I can maybe get my a, a second heal. That would be wild. I don't. I don't know if I'll be able to tank it this long though. Nope. Potion. We're gonna try it. We're gonna try to do this pull. It's way too. Oh no. There's even more. Crap. 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 And heal. 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 Ah! Nope. Not. It's not doable. Yeah, the repair bill's like 200,000. I know. <laughs> I wanted to see if I could do it for the for the cameras, man. It was for the glory. It's okay. We got 27 faction points for capturing the zone. It'll be all right. <laughs> yeah, we, we definitely can't pull that many. Not not without Hellion Jacket and, and some defensives. With with full offensives, no, it ain't happening. We'll, we'll do the... We'll, we'll do a four-man, a little four-pull. Here we go. Just one archer, you know? Not too bad. Hit them with all the stuff that we've got here. If I potioned earlier, I might have been able to do it, but, you know, I'm greedy. Potions are expensive, and I'm not crafting them currently. And I don't feel like importing them from Brazilian either. Oh, boy. There we go. We did it. And no one saw us. Nope, this video, it'll get zero views. No one will ever know that it happened. All right, don't snitch on me in the comments. <laughs> oh, we got we got one wizard, one wizard in this pool. See, th this isn't all melee pool. This is simple to do. Watch me get downed again because I'm not awake. I am not awoken. And laser and vape and W laser beam. Yep. It's just that easy with the melees. See, no probs. But when you have those archers, man, they. They, they take your health away. That's what they're built for. They, The archers on the undead team, they're doing their job. They actually get paid a decent salary to stop invaders like me. Whereas the melee guys, they don't get paid enough. So they're just, they just kind of half-heartedly swing at you. They're just like, eh, whatever. And then the pukey boys, well, you know, they're, they're new to the, they're the newbies. They're the new hires. <laughs> 
go. Just look at that HP remote. The great thing about uh, these pulls are they're just very high den there's it's high density. You're getting you're getting a lot of dudes. You just you just pull so many at once. I I bet I could do one wizard double archer. I feel confident. I'm feeling very confident in being able to do this one. But man do they hurt. They hurt so bad. I don't like it. And heal! Let's summon the healing powers from the We had this one archer on the outskirts here, just, you know, he avoided all the death. He is the sole survivor. Not anymore, though. Okay. Our mount is badly wounded. We, let's walk it off. Hopefully no greens come out. Play. Boy, oh boy. Let's kill these double wizards here while my mount heals. 13 seconds. That's fine. Just hit them with all the spells that aren't our dark magics. And they just go pop. But we'll, we'll just freaking pull every group. <laughs> Even though these aren't really like the best groups to pull. Like normally I just skip them because there's only three. But I'm, I'm just, I'm being lazy today. I'm going to be lazy fame farming, not whole hyper super efficient fame farming. Uh, oh, you know what? I think I realized why I failed the other pull. My my freaking lifesteal food ran out, so let's eat some. I don't have any food buffs right now. That's scary to think about. Roast pork. Maybe you can rewind the video and let me know. Did I did I have it for that one pull? Did I not? That is a tiny little puny, like, spawn. Ew. You guys need to grow some bigger bones so I can get more fame. The bigger the bones, the more fame they give. <laughs> Oh man, this area is cleaned out. Freaking every oh, that's juicy. I'll I'll fight I'll fight these dudes. They're they're nice and enchanted up for us. They're all dolled up for the the grand ball, the undead gala or something. What the hell is a gala? Who calls it a gala? What the fuck is a gala? No, uh, Mr. Undead, don't hurt me. I it's my first time ever <laughs> at the gala. I left my one cultist sandal behind, and my chariot thing is a giant bear instead of a pumpkin or something. Uh, if Cinderella was a big buff dude that had dark magic, <laughs> make it happen, AI generators. <laughs> or don't. I don't care about Cinderella's Disney crap. Or, I know it existed before Disney, but Disney's the one who made it popular, so they own it now. Sorry, that's just how it works. <laughs> That's just how it is. Dang you archers and your dodging abilities. Always making it unfun for the player to fight you. Um, look at them spread out. Ugh, I'm getting on the bear. That's right. The bear is activated. That really activates my almonds. <laughs> you ever heard, hear that phrase? That really activates my almonds, bro. <laughs> I don't know what it means. I just like to say it because it's funny and confusing. Like most people like to say things that they don't truly understand. We must kill the undead. Again, 5,000 points received. Oh, I can spend those points on little fame chests. Yes. Let's get them. Oh, we got Joey. He's coming up. He wants my fame mobs. And I want to heal myself. I'm really low on HP. Good thing that um, <laughs> that the the shadow caller is very unbalanced for this. If I was a dev, I would have nerfed this a long time. I would have nerfed this on the first day. I wouldn't have ever released life steal food. The game completely changed with the life steal food forever. It's never going to return. Uh, archers. I don't want archers or mages but i'm gonna fight you both i'm gonna fight all of you at the same time maybe if i can get you bunched up get you nice and crunched up together a big ball a big death ball it's like stick together no don't stick together against soul binge that's how we die that's how he gets us that's how he milks us for fame uh who why is it so pretentious why don't they just call it experience points that's always bugged me and no one ever points it out you know, every freaking video game ever, that when you kill shit and you get stronger, it's experience points. You're leveling up. You're not faming up. You're not getting fame. You're getting experience. Ugh. Ugh, puke. Gag. Barf. 
<laughs> Dang it, Joey. You done farmed. What is the accent from Yu-Gi-Oh? It's like, damn it, Joey. But Yug, I got a fame farm, Yug. I got a fame farm in the statics, Yug. Oh, except instead of Yug, it's swole. Ah, uh, the chest was recently looted. I can smell it. I can smell its foul odor. Joey, you didn't leave me any fame farm, Joey. <laughs> oh, swole. I got a fame farm from my, my blind sister, Yug. Yugi. Oh man, I wish I could transform into a freaking Egyptian prince or whatever the hell it is. I wish I had a secret magic puzzle piece that always let me draw the winning card. Spoiler alert, that's what the Millennium Puzzle does, just letting you know. Just heads up. You know, I have a Mandela effect about Yu-Gi-Oh! the first season. Um, it didn't end the way it's it, it ended in this universe, in this dimension, whatever you want to call it. It ended way differently. I think I pointed this out in a video before, but, um... Ah... Uh, <laughs> like, okay, so, in my dimension, it ended with a 1v1 from Yami and Yugi, and there were no friends around, and it was serious. It wasn't like, lighthearted, haha, let's fight, oh my god, I won, lol, XD. It was like, if you don't defeat me, then I will never get to go back to my world, or whatever the fuck. And there, there was no f anime friends cheering them on. It was just them in a 1v1. And no, it wasn't some edit or cut that some, some dude just did. It was literally what aired on the television at the time. So, uh, Speaking of, there, there's a new Mandela effect that I'm not part of, but I'm curious if you guys know about it. There was some shaving ad, some Gillette ad a long time ago of like a baseball player. He's being interviewed by a girl. And they hit the ball to him, and he catches it midair, and he's like, yo, you gotta watch out where you're batting or something. And he throws the ball back. Now, everyone's saying the Mandela effect is that the girl interviewing him was a white girl, but in this dimension, it's a black girl. So I'm kind of curious if you guys remember that commercial, because it's apparently an older one. I don't really remember the commercial. I don't really pay attention to commercials much, but um, there was like thousands of people saying that that, that recently happened, so... I'm just giving you the heads up, man. I, I actually come from a dimension where um, South America's uh, Brazil lined up with uh, the United States state of Texas. Uh, and they were both in the central time zone. But if you look at the maps now, it's like Brazil is way off to the right. It does not line up with Texas at all. And I am I'm getting beat up here. This is actually kind of getting a little dangerous, but these are not enchanted mobs. So, yeah, we can, we, can, we can function. It's the dang archers, man. When the archers start to party hard, that's when you gotta worry. Because they're really annoying to fight and stuff, and they deal lots of damage. Oh, look at that juicing mob that just popped into existence. He just got beamed. He just, like, crawled out of the dirt. Fully enchanted. Fully stinky. You can see the smell lines. Definitely want to grab him. And his little bone friends, and his melee friends, and art not the archer, no. Okay, this is, this is getting a beefy, this is getting kind of beefy. We got some beefers. Beefy boys. And armor shred into heal, into vape, into armor, into laser beam. Look at them melt. As, as they should melt. What they deserve. They get what they deserve. I stood in the middle of that so it didn't knock me out of my mount range. By the way, I know it hurts, but hey, it's better than being flung around and hurting. So it's the lesser of the two evils. Winkers. Boy, oh boy, look at all the fame we're getting. Oh man, look how much silver I'm- like, I'm down to 95.5. I was at 99.5. We spent 4 million silver this video. This video cost me 4 million silver, whatever will I do? Uh, I'm just gonna open the gold shop and exchange some of my gold for silver. Because I don't have any money-making methods left in the game. I don't farm. I don't really honestly gather. I don't, um... <laughs> I don't have any characters with premium active ever. And yes, I know I could farm way more if I had premium active, by the way. Look here in the top right. I don't have premium active. So yeah, th these would be given even more fame if I did. Uh, let's see, how much? I, I need 4 million silver. 4, 0, 0, 0, 0, 0, 0. That's going to cost me 840 gold. <laughs> uh, we spent 840 gold in today's fame farming adventure. And we still have 21 minutes of food buff left. Alright, buckos. Let's 
da 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 duel. So, <laughs> here's a question for y'all, because I can't be the only one, and I know I've asked this in a video before, but I don't remember anyone ever replying or answering. So, on the Yu-Gi-Oh! cartoon show, the American dub, English dub, whatever the hell it is, I don't know why I called it American, um, the intro song, it's like, it's time to da 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 duel uh, and then at some point you hear, Yamu! Now, is, are they saying Yamu as in, like, like Shamu but Yamu, or are they saying your move? Because I've always heard it as Yamu, and then me being a kid, or a teenager, I don't remember how old I was when that shit aired, uh, and I would, you know, sing along to it because autism, and I would be like, Yamu! And then everyone would just be like, what the fuck are you saying? They're like, I'm saying the theme song. What are you, what are you saying? You ain't saying nothing because you're timid. You won't sing along because you're afraid of being shamed about it. Bro, like, why do you care? It's catchy. It's funny. Everyone, everyone says the did it, did it, did it, did it, duel part, you know, but no one says the rest of the damn song. Stop leaving the rest of the song out. It, it feels sad. You gotta be all inclusive with your songs. Man, I don't like this double archer pool. I don't like it one bit. It's a little spooky. It's a little... Oh, man. Can I dodge that? I did not dodge that. No. Let me dodge it. I deserve to dodge it. I deserve... <laughs> I deserve... Reparations. <laughs> reparations. Who... <Ooh. laughs> oh, man. I thought about making the most pretentious, like, either a live stream or a video where I demand Albion reparations. <laughs> Um, just like a stream me sitting in Bridgewatch and see how much people donate. Because no one's really done that. And I don't mean like begging random strangers, I mean begging the viewers. Alright viewers, these videos aren't gonna fund themselves. I need your, your silver stat, give it, give them here. <laughs> people would just get pissed and unsub. As they rightfully should. But, oh we got a chest. Uh, I don't know if I can do this. Two archers. We already have a freaking archer pole. Joey's gonna come steal it. He's like, hey, Yug, I got the chest, Yug. It was worth a million silver. Uh, Lamau. If I could still talk, dude. <laughs> I used to talk all the time when I would down people or fight them in yellow zones and stuff. I, mi I miss it. I was looking at some old clips back when the Spectre Jacket actually uh, melted your HP and not your maximum HP. And, um... Like, I downed some guy with, with a Spectre jacket, and I was just, like, saying Lamau a bunch to him. You know, really asshole behavior, but hey, that, it's Albion! That's the point of the freaking game. You're supposed to be a jerk in video games. Because you can't be a jerk in the real world, so you might as well be one in video games. You know? <laughs> oh no. Oh no, I'm melting all the bad boys. I'm the bad boy. I'm the villain of the story. The skeletons are the good guys. Alright, chest. Show me your 20k loot. Juicy. Not really. That's not juicy at all. We've lost... <laughs> we've we're at 94.9 million dollar dues. These are little baby wizards. They're not gonna hurt us that bad. But it's the big, chunky, jumpy boys that we're, I'm worried about. Those are the big hitters. The big hitter spitters. <laughs> oh. Look at him die. Look at the fame. Roll in. Roll that beautiful bean footage. That's another old commercial. Bush's Baked Beans, I think it was. I think that's the brand of it. It's got the doggo, and the dog has the bean recipe, and he'll never tell. Or something. I don't know. <laughs> what is up with food companies and list secret recipes? I think it's weird. Yeah, you want to know what the KFC... 12, is it 12? I don't even know how many. Secret herbs and spices? Yeah, it's like, um, demons and children's skin or something. I don't know. Oh, shoot. My mount has, has died. Your mount has fallen in battle. Wah! A hero has fallen. <laughs> Our champion has been slain. Oh. Uh. I think that's what it says in Warcraft 3. It's like, our champion has been slain. Sorry, I just had to take a little stretchy break. You know, I, I still just woke up. There's an archer boy. 
He was just an archer boy. I said, see you later, boy. He was not undead enough for me. He's got a skelly career. And I don't know the lyrics to the actual real song, so I can't mimic it. Um. <laughs> he was a Twitch streamer boy. I said, see you later, boy. <laughs> oh, man. How come no one's made that parody yet? Or have they? I bet they probably have. It would be something some e-girl would do, probably. <laughs> oh, man. Oh, wait, yeah, I think Belle Delphine did it. Whoops. <laughs> man, I'm forgetful sometimes. Yeah, with Too Mad. Dude, Too Mad's funny as hell, dude. That guy's that guy's a freaking... He's, he's hella funny. But uh, he kind of takes it too far in real life sometimes. Like, uh, getting kicked out of Six Flags, bro. Like... Just like, come on, man. There was way more stuff in the vid you could have made, but he got kicked out too soon. He took him away. Joey's over here still farming. Me and Joey. The duo. Except we're not. He's just a stranger. Stranger danger. <laughs> High voltage. Is that how that song goes? <laughs> oh, no. We have to kill the undead to free our family from... Everlasting gobstoppers or something. I don't. Dude, I haven't had a gobstopper in 20 years. 22 years. <laughs> the chewy ones, man, I remember. They were a dollar. <laughs> I wonder how much they are now. They're probably like five dollars. Okay, Archer, you're getting real spooky with your stink lines. With your smelly bones. That you you don't drink enough calcium, Mr. Bones. Mr. Bones, he drinks the calcium, he gets real strong, he gets melted by the demonic doomsday lasers that I shoot out, and the poison circles on the ground. How the hell does an, a raining arrow have such a big hitbox? You can, like, are you, are you shooting boulders out of your bow? That would be a cool, like, anime spell. You shoot an arrow into the air, and as it falls to the ground, it just gets bigger and bigger and fatter and heavier. And by the time it hits the ground, it's like a freaking, like, uh, AC-140 shell. <laughs> oh, man. AC-140 inbound! There's this, there's this meme on Twitter that I've been seeing. It's like, some bullshit company tweeted that you shouldn't do war crimes even in video games. And now everyone's posting their war crimes from video games. And one of them is like, uh, in some Call of Duty game where it's like, don't... Don't shoot the children and the mother, and then they just kill the children and the mother. I don't know. Why do I talk about this stuff? The, 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 the way I have conversations with you is it's like that awkwardness, like that awkward kid at school that's like, Hey, you know, I'm just gonna keep talking to you until you, like, walk away awkwardly from me, right? And, uh, they just say the weirdest, wildest, spiciest memes sometimes, and you just, like, shake your head. You just face palm, you're like, oh god, he's talking about that thing again. <laughs> oh, jeez. Hmm. But, you know, sometimes those kids grow out of it, man. I grew up and there was this one kid, and he was obsessed with... <laughs> Dude, this kid was obsessed with tornadoes. He would always, like, at recess, he would just spin. He would just spin around. He loved tornadoes. Tornadoes were the coolest shit ever. And, um, like, I didn't see him again until, like, high school. And, uh, I was like, hey, you still like tornadoes? And he flipped the fuck out when talk to me. He, he, it pissed him off. Like, it was embarrassing or something. It's like, bro, it's okay to like things. You know? And then change your mind later, I guess. But I guess everyone bullied him for it. And he just automatically assumed that I was gonna, gonna bully him for liking tornadoes and spinning around in circles in recess. I mean, me, I just, I just fought in recess. I just made sure the teacher wasn't watching and then... Uh, me and other kids would just punch each other in the face, kick each other as hard as we could, because we wanted to toughen up, you know, for the streets. <laughs> uh, just to see who could piss off who first and throw the first punch. Oh, I'm trolling you. No, I troll you. Oh, you went too far. Um. And attack and kill, and we still have, like... How much time on our food buff? Another, uh, come on. Let me look at my food buff timer. 11 minutes, 48 seconds. I'm just gonna eat that. I'm just gonna eat that attack. Mr. Dread Knight. 
Mr. Dread Knight, he likes to slash his sword on me. He's very slow, though. He's, he's not a very good swordsman, because he only slashes, like, once every few seconds. Maybe he just gets out of breath really fast. What is this guy doing? Mr. DX... DX Aid? Oh, he's, uh... He's got the... He's got the, the pussy boots. Oh no, I'm about to die, goes invisible. I don't need to drop aggro. I'm I've got the Chad boots. Me, I shred the armor. That's how that's how men fight. We don't back down. We take our repair bills with stride. Uh, see look at this. I'm shredding the armor. I'm killing these so much faster than some dude that doesn't use his boots offensively. Yep, yep, -ers. I don't want the tier 2 armor. Get it out of my inventory. Get it out of here. Ew, I touched it. Gross. Need to wash my hands in the local piss river. <laughs> uh, yes, that's right. I'm making fun of my comrades' builds for being timid. Timid. Timid build much? Oh, he's timid. He's scared. He doesn't want to get killed, so he goes invisible. Man. Man, what, what are we going to do about it? Joey, DX8. I wish I could, like, bro, I really honestly super duper wish that when you PvP flagged in a zone, that you could fight faction flag players in yellows. Because I know this is a blue zone and you can't PvP flag anyway, but damn, do I wish you could. I'm stealing your, uh, your pull here, bro. Stealing your pull, because, uh, you backed out. So it's mine now. It's my pull. I, I made this pool. I made the YouTube video. It's my build. No one's allowed to have it. No one's allowed to remake it. That, that's such a stupid thing. Oh man, my mount's like super dying, so I'm gonna like, I'm just gonna walk away from it for a while and forget it exists. And then summon a new one. That's how it works. Don't ask me. I didn't program the game. So like, people are like, they, they think they own an idea. They're like, I made this build. You can't make a video on my build. I'm like, that's, well, it's not how that works. Otherwise, the first guy ever to play the game would just make every video, and the, and then no one can make videos anymore on the game. That's not how that works, bro. Uh, but secondly, it's like, um, like like the mule thing. I was, I am not the OG author of the mule thing. Not not at all, right? I gave, I'm pretty sure I gave credit to Dark Lord when I made that. Uh, but then you have people like like someone, the, the guy that leaked it. He says he didn't get it from my members channel, which. I looked through my members list, and he wasn't a member, so I, I believe him. I, you know, maybe he just discovered it on his own, or maybe he was the one other dude to, to see Dark Lord's video, and he decided to make a video. I don't know, we'll never know, or maybe he figured it out on his own. Maybe so he saw it in Discord. Someone who hates my guts, but watches my videos, is like, hey, here's a thing you can do. I don't want to give Soul Benji any views, though. Lamal, XD, like, like, bro, it's like... <laughs> Not giving me one view, who cares? <laughs> uh, I am not able to pull all of them at once, that's sad, but... Uh, and, then, and then he's like, 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 that guy's trying to apologize, he's like, Sorry, I didn't know you made the video already. It's like, it's cool! I don't care, make the video! You know, do whatever you want to do. Don't let someone impose that you can or can't do something. That's, that's always been my thing, right? You're free to do whatever the hell you want. Don't let some random person on the internet tell you that you can't do something. <laughs> um, do I want... I don't want that archer. I, I, I really don't want to pull that archer. Luckily, this is a little baby archer, so... I don't think they dart around. They haven't learned how to, how to run fast yet. They haven't learned how to spread their wings and fly. Oh man, so as a kid, you know, I would go to the dentist, and it was one of those kid- Ah, oh, crap, I got freaking knocked. Uh, I would always go to one of those little pediatric dentists, or, you know, kid dentists, or whatever, right? And, uh, what they had you do is they had you select a movie to watch while they did your dental work to distract you, because they wanted to distract children from, you know, knowing that people are poking and prodding around in their teeth and their mouth. And, um, I would always pick the most annoying movie that pissed off the staff. Uh, and that was Space Jam. Not the new one. I wasn't a freaking kid a couple years ago, okay? I'm talking about the old Space Jam, you know, with, you know, the good one, not the cringe one. <laughs> oh, crap. This is kind of a hard pull. We got a lot of archers. I'm gonna have to kill the melees. Oh, no, I have no mounts. What am, whatever will I do? Uh, I'll get to my story in a bit. This is kind of a high concentration pull here. Oh, I barely got that off before the stun arrow hit. 
That is very spooky. The spookiest of pulls. Well, we, we managed to do it very cleanly. I'm nearly full HP. Very proud. Are you proud, Mom? I'm playing video games. <laughs> and not, not working a job. Anyway, so um, I would pick Space Jam as the movie. And you could tell the staff hated, hated that movie. They hated the songs. They hated basketball. They didn't like it. They were just like... They would roll their eyes and I'd be like, I want to watch Space Jam! <laughs> That was not how I spoke as a child. I did not have a squeaky child voice. Okay, maybe it's a little higher pitched than it is now. Maybe not. Maybe I had a really deep voice. It's like a deep voice little child. Like, hello, I am six years old. I was not six years old when Space Jam came out. I'm gonna tell you that now. I was older. I don't remember how old I was when Space Jam came out, but I was probably maybe close to being a teenager. I don't freaking remember. But, <laughs> like, I would just pick it to piss them off. What's wrong with me, guys? <laughs> uh, making the dentist wages mad. How dare me? How dare I? How dare me? What's wrong with my grammar? Am I losing my mind? It's over. It's over, grammar bros. Oh. Uh. And they, like, like because I was kind of a regular, I guess, they would, like, they would just start picking it for me, like, oh, so you want to watch Space Jam, right? I'm like, yeah! Put it on! <laughs> And then at some point, they just got rid of it, <laughs> like... <laughs> and then I, I asked them, I was like, what happened to Space Jam? And they're like, oh, we rotated it out. So I'm like, what does that mean? And they're like, don't worry about it. I'm an adult, I don't have to answer you, kid. I don't have to explain myself. I always hate that about freaking adults that talk to children, even if they're their parents. If a child asks you why, and you say, because I said so, you lose. I am, as a kid, I'm not going to acknowledge your authority that, oh, uh, I'm an adult because I said so, because I'm telling you to, blah, 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 blah. No, tell me why. Tell me why you won't tell me what words mean. Tell me why that I shouldn't touch the, the high voltage power lines. Tell, you know, give me a reason, because if you don't, here's the thing. As a YouTuber, when I'm teaching you how to do shit in Albion Online, guess what? I don't tell you to do something because I told you to, because I said so. I tell you the reason why. Why am I farming statics? Because it gives me the highest fame per hour as a solo player. <laughs> Not because I said so, just trust me, bro. Just trust the science. <laughs> just trust the science, they say. Man, this video is almost an hour long. What's going on with my life? I have spent so much Silverinos today. Oh, we're down to 93 million, guys. It's over. Silver bros. We'll never recover. It's all Joey's fault. We're gonna find Joey. And we're gonna inspect him or something. Maybe join his Discord and be like, Why are you farming, huh? This is my zone. I own this zone. You better leave right now because I said so. <laughs> uh, and then, uh, here's, like, you hear this too from people that can't argue or reason or explain. Because they're just simple-minded, simple-brained. Um, especially online arguments. Like, you're in a Discord with some dipshit guild, and then some old guy is like, You need to pull Anixia this way. And I'm like, why? And he's like, because I said so. I'm your elder. Respect me. I'm like, I'm a pro gamer. Respect me. I get paid to play video games. At least when World of Warcraft was new. Uh, I was in a Counter-Strike League. I was doing the Halo business. You know, I was doing Tekken. I was doing a bunch of games all at once. It's probably why I was never number one at any of them. But hey, you know, it's better to milk four to five local tournaments than one big ass tournament and then not win. That was my motto, right? So I would just do. I'd just milk all the local tournaments. Uh, this pool sucks because the archers are stupid and I hate them and they smell bad and no one likes them. And archers, man, they're nerds. They're little bow nerds. They like to do their fletching. And they talk about bird feathers and stuff. And uh, and they're not very liked at archer school or night school or whatever, I don't know. Uh, you know, it's, it's like there was, there was a whole string of animes this year and they all involve going to school. And it's like, I know it's like a night school or a mage school. Even the new Konosuba is, is Megumin going to fucking school. I hate that. 
Stop sending- stop making things about school. I hate school so much that I don't want to watch an anime about school. Oh, and like Harry Potter, that's about going to school. Fuck school, okay? I'm gonna say it right now. YouTube doesn't like it when I say fuck school, but fuck school. School sucks. It's not fun. I don't want to be there. Uh, I don't think anyone should be forced to go. I don't care that it, you know, you have to be educated. Educate people other ways. Just let them learn hands-on. Hey, kid, do you want to do uh, calculus? No? Do you want to build houses? Yes? Okay, let's go build some houses. Let me show you how it works. You put the brick on the sticky part. <laughs> uh, you put the brick on the sticky part. <laughs> but you don't put it sideways, okay? You gotta put it straight or something. I don't know how house building works. Do people even use bricks anymore? Are bricks, do they even exist? How come people don't make things with stone? Like, you look at all the medieval shit, and they got all these cool stone archways and things made of stone. And these days, I'm getting hurt. I'm gonna potion because I'm afraid. I'm, I'm, I'm really afraid of the stupid archer that's hurting my butthole. Because, you know, there we go. We did it. We did potion, though. How many potions have I burned today? I'm down to six potions. I think I drank four potions. Four potions per hour. That's like 32,000 silver. Oh, man. Don't mind the, the respect cost, though. <laughs> But yeah, like back in the day, you know, castles were made of stone. The pyramids were made of sandstone. You know, you, you got like there's a lot going on. What happened? Why don't why can't uh, why can't we build things with stone? Why can't I go out into the wilderness and I am really getting beat up here? Why can't I go out into the wilderness and and grab some stone, you know, from the ground and sell it to somebody or learn how to shape it into cool squares? I am still- I am getting beat the hell up here. I, I might have to flee from this. I am really not paying attention to what I'm doing. And it's getting a little spooky. Oh, that's- oh, we're freaking down to the wire. Oh, how low did my HP get there? Man, I really should, like, I don't know, stop talking about stupid crap for a sec. Um, okay, so about stone, yeah, why can't I just go out into the wilderness and grab a bunch of rocks off the ground and then give it to a guy and he makes it into pretty bricks and then he makes that into a house or something, right? What happened to that? Now it's like, oh, you gotta make concrete, which is like weaker than stone. I mean, you see how it decays in the wilderness, right? And stuff. It makes no sense. Why are we regressing our technology? You know, things made of stone last forever, like stone roads, stone whatever. Is it just too tedious? Did it really take that long to build shit back in the day or something? Did it really cost that much compared to... Like, people are fucking loaded with money now. Like, people are so insanely rich that they just buy multi-million dollar homes. But the ho the homes that they buy are made of, like, paper. Paper walls and, and stuff. I don't under... Man, I, I was way off of that cast. I, like, AoE'd the air. I'll show you my power by casting this spell in a general direction that you're not standing in. Oh, my food buff ran out. That's why I'm taking so much damage. Okay. Wait, did it... I thought I had more time. Well, that's... That's the fame farm. We have eight... Oh, that's the... Well, that's the husky. The husky's half that. I'll... I'll calculate. Let's teleport home. That's gonna cost 69. One, two, three. That's a fun number. The, the teleport home thing is always a different number. It's never, like, the same. Uh, once I teleport home, I'll open my... Destiny board, and we'll see how many little combat fame credits we earn. Let's pop it back on the screen. Starting starting combat fame credits. Ending combat fame credits. Yeah, boy. We're at uh, 52, uh, 577, 471. Combat fame credits earned. Let's see now, and let's do some little mathy maths. Okay, we got 52, 5, 7, 7, 4, 7, 1, and then we subtract 48, 7, 8, 4, 9, 30. We earned 3.792 million. Look at that. Isn't it a beaut? Isn't it a beaut? All right, so fame earned in 30 minutes. All you do is multiply it by 2, baby. There you go, 7.5 million fame, which would be... Uh, multiply that by two. <laughs> so, fame per hour, no premium, would be 15 million fame per hour. Look at that. Isn't it freaking glorious and beautiful and, and just 
Nice. This is nice. Let's let's repair our gear. We're, gear. We're, we got down. That's three hundred fifty-six thousand silverinos. Fifteen point seven. And do I need to explain this? I guess I can explain it because there's always some redditor that's like, ah, he's making up numbers. He's doing the math wrong. No, I'm not. I am not doing the math wrong because here's how the math freaking works. One combat fame credit at its lowest possible conversion is worth two fame on weapons. So to level up Spear, it's from level 18 to 19. It takes 41,701 combat fame credits, which is equivalent to 83,402 fame. So therefore, I farmed that amount of fame, and I don't give a shit about the stupid stats page. No one cares about the stats page. Look at this. I'll, I'll show you why no one cares about the damn stats page. Look at this. Fame for killing mobs, 229 million. Look how much fame I have on my destiny board. I'll just show you the weapons. Let's start with Warlock. All right. This is level 100 Shadow Caller. That is roughly 34 million fame. We'll say 30. We'll round it all the way down. 33, 66, 99. So there's half. 33, 66, 99. Uh, there's another 33. So we can already say that's over 200 million. Okay. That's one weapon line. Guess what? I have other weapon lines also maxed out. Here's the bow line. That's another 200 million fame. Guess what? All this armor, all these offhands. Look at that. Another 200 million fame in crossbows. You know, there's a there's another 33 million. Okay, there's uh, 33 million, 33 million. This one's 104 level 114. Look at that. That's 76 million. Okay, it's. It's way, way more fame than 229 million. All right, do you understand now? Redditors, freaking idiots. Redditors are so damn stupid. Uh, I was I was looking at Reddit the other day, and there was a guy that said you don't get bonus experience for being faction flagged. Yes, you do. Yes, you absolutely do, Caf Captain Muffinator. You idiot, you dummy. Look at this. I stepped out one zone away. Guess what the tooltip says? 5% more fame, 5% more silver, 5% more loot. You go three zones away, that's 15%. You're sitting there telling people on Reddit that by faction flagging, you don't gain additional uh, fame? Yes, you do. Yes, you absolutely freaking do. All right, and our fame farm, you know, we we definitely can open one of these. Just, I'm just going to open both. And look at that. We got 450,000 more fame in combat tomes. So there you go. That's pushing almost 16 million fame. You know, per hour, 17 million even. And that's without premium. With premium. And if I had the zone to myself and it's fame week. And I have the, what is this? The Conqueror's Challenge little fame boosties here. And if I have an Avalonian Raid boost. Oh boy, oh boy. It gets nutty. It gets wild and crazy. Wild and wacky. Anyway, that's the video. I'm Soul Benji. Thanks for watching my fame farming video. Uh, as always, be a bro, stay swole. Whatever that means. Just... Be a troll and piss off Reddit. Fuck them, okay? <laughs> make them make mad. Stop adding me to friends list. I don't know you, Julian. I don't freaking know you, guildmaster of some something here. Okay, you've never talked to me once. Why are you adding me to friends list, huh? Why are you adding me to friends list, Julian? Everyone add... Fr everybody watching this, add this guy. Ask him. Ask him. I can't ask him. I'm muted. I can't talk. Okay, I'm perma-muted. I'm not allowed to talk. SBI deems it too dangerous if I talk. Uh, with that said, make sure you like the video because Reddit's gonna dislike the video because I'm talking crap about them. And also, become a channel member. Button's right down here, five bucks a month. Okay, you get access to private, more personal videos that are really good. Advanced guides, too good for the public. So go ahead and check those out. Uh, thank you so much for the support. Where's that husky? Get in there, husky. Okay. 550,000. Look at that. In one hour. Not terrible, I guess. Um, you know, that's mostly the dungeon, but whatever. Also, make sure you're subscribed so you don't miss the next video. And on the right side of your screen, there's a video that you should absolutely click. If you don't click it, you're going to stub your toe tomorrow.